Okay, the next situation, again, is going to facilitate movement maybe to a ball that's off the net, low, maybe a little bit behind her. So what she's going to do is a three-step pattern. Again, left foot series, so her left foot's going to lead, and it's going to be left, right, left, and then she'll plant on her left foot. So Jordan will demonstrate without a ball. So she gets the ball with her left foot, kind of pivots on her toe, so when she actually touches the ball, she's squared up to left front, we want to make sure that as she delivers the ball, her upper body is staying vertical. Again, whenever something's going on behind you, the tendency is to fall backward. And we can see that it's sometimes unavoidable to not have your lower body be going backward, but she has to stay vertical with her shoulders, and that will provide a platform where she can still push the ball out. Push the ball out. And these are for balls that are kind of low and behind her, where again, she doesn't have time to get to the ball, get squared up, face left front before she touches it. Again, in the ideal world, she will do that. So now, Jordan, I'm going to deliver you the same ball, but it's going to be high where you do have time. You know, three steps, left, right, push through. So if she has time, we want her to do that. So same ball, great, not a problem. But if she doesn't have time, She's rehearsed that movement where she can just drive her hips around the ball, have her left foot planted, be solid with her upper body, and still deliver a good ball.